Dr. Sylvester Ekpodu was born in 1966. He recently obtained Doctor of Philosophy from the University of Port Harcourt. His academic journey in the tertiary education started in 1998 when he obtained degree in government and public administration from Abia State University. Not satisfied with a bachelor's degree, Dr. Sylvester Ekpedu progressed to the University of Port Harcourt for postgraduate diploma in international affairs from 2012 to 2014. He enrolled for a master's degree at the University of Port Harcourt in 2017, where he graduated in flying colors. Dr. Sylvester's quest for education pushed him to secure his PhD program, which he successfully completed in 2022. <music> Family and friends of Dr. Sylvester Ekpedu spoke on his successful PhD program. All the things in nomenclature, he has to be addressed properly because it's not easy to be a doctor. We appreciate his doggedness, ruggedity and belief that he can make it and he has made it. We are proud, we are happy. He's a friend, more than a friend, a brother. And we belong to the same faith. We are both counselors in Christ Jesus Church of God. And uh, for you to be a counselor in Christ Jesus Church of God, you know, it takes a lot. We're just at the end of us worldwide as a member of the governing council of the church. So it's somebody I know too well and we're very happy and we're proud of him. I'm excited that this has come to fruition because I understand he has put on so much, you know, effort, commitment and demonstrated so much courage to indeed do this. If you had asked me, I wouldn't have thought it was possible. I thought he was just joking about it. But <laughs> finally, it has come to pass and um, I rejoice with him and celebrate him as a man of courage and I thank God to have made this possible. Oh, I feel excited. I must tell you that this is where this is They have worked hard for this. It is his life ambition, you know, to indeed be able to essay academically. And today it has come to pass with the fruition. I celebrate with him and I'm very, very excited about this. I'm happy. His wife, Mrs. Lovett Sylvester Ekpedu, speaks. I feel so great, I feel so honored because um, to be a PhD holder is not easy. It's not easy at all. Like I said, it wasn't easy. You know, he leaves the house early, go to work. And uh, when I will be expecting him, 
I'm is going to call by four and I call him to tell your food is ready. Can you just come around and tell me in school? Before I will see him, it's like 10 p.m. Tony is good. Oh, I call all the names. At times I call him, sweetheart. At times when I want his uncle to be there, I call him, Doctor Sylvester. <laughs> I want to know why. I also call him Sylvester Epudu PhD. <laughs> Essentially, when I'm targeting something. My Christmas message to him is that. Um, now he has achieved his PhD. Um, I wish him well, wish him long life, um, uh, more money, good health. And uh, I've also told him that um, there's nothing like I'm going to school, I have lectures. Now, this Christmas, I'm not going to celebrate it right here for Taco. He should be ready to take me somewhere. Dr. Sylvester Ekpedu is an elder and member of Council of Christ Chosen Church of God and a recipient of many awards. He is the chairman, chief executive officer of a slow bolus group of companies with headquarters in Port Harcourt. He speaks on his educational achievements. Yes, uh, apart from the main creature, I, I know a lot now expected from me because of the uh, academic height that I've attained. And uh, we look at PhD as uh, just uh, acquisition of a certificate for, for sure for aggrandizement. And PhD is actually about uh, uh, PhD is about research. PhD holders are problem solvers. So um, I, I don't look at things from the ordinary perspective. Once uh, you, you, you present a situation, first thing that comes to my mind is what is the cause of this problem? How can this thing be resolved? So I know a lot is expected from me. Among my friends, the, uh, my faith, my church, my family, even the society, now that I've attained my lifelong academic height, APA. And there's, there's a way to expect uh, a first degree holder or even master's degree holder to behave and not be disappointed. So, if I, for example, if I jump out from a vessel and begin to fight a probe, how would someone who is a doctor be doing that So, it has also um, called to my mind that I need to. Um, Exhibit some very high sense of the problem and knowledge. Yeah, even though these people call a PhD the terminal degree, which is correct, I'm already thinking of uh, floating a book. I, I need to begin to show to people the benefit of what I have uh, acquired in books, in journals, in presentations. And maybe while still doing my business in the future, I could pick up a temporary, uh, part-time uh, lecturing on free the uh, movie uh, computer to support the society. It might not really be for talent. I wish my wife very supportive wife, very very supportive. I wish she. Put this on the CNN, right? She's very supportive. She actually made this my PhD possible because uh, uh, each time I go out, I remember that I have a very supportive wife to look after the kids, to take care of the home from. So I wish her a very happy Christmas. I wish us a very happy Christmas. Uh, same with the kids who uh, were able to live a life that looks more like half a presence of uh, their dad. Their husband. A very happy Christmas. We look forward to a better me. A 
in the year 2023. Dr. Sylvester Epedu is married to one wife and the marriage has produced five children.